Uh, let's see. Oh, I think some of you didn't attend this day right right now, so please notice them, right? Fifty-five, thirty-five, right? Thirty-five people notice. Could be thirty-six, I think. Okay. Uh, today, today's class, you, you can hear me that uh, the really bad code for and my voice is quite weird. So maybe I will speak, uh, speak not that lot, speak less, but I will do the practice and the design slowly, right, to make it better for you to understand what's going on. Okay. Thank you, Yanshi. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and don't uh never mind about my voice okay it's quite a bit i know that and it's really funny <laughs> <coughs> um so the last class we got a homework right see that here's a homework so some of you have sent me the homework uh by the wechat and maybe some of you didn't so if you if you done your homework, you can submit to the WeChat or just uh, send it at a Tencent at a Tencent meeting. Okay, you can submit it to you. Uh, let's see in the chat in the Tencent chat. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Okay, now of you send me we are the Tencent meeting. Okay, so if you, I think. There might be some problems, some questions about this homework right here. Um, it's there are two points for this to, uh, for this homework today. I think um, maybe you will draw uh, will be when you do your homework and do this design. Maybe you will occur some of some error or some problems you've got. I will so consider about that. I will get you. I will make the homework and show you how to make it uh, for today's class first, right? All right. So for this field right here, so uh, uh, as we as we learned about it, to use the to use the revolve revolve both right here. See that the picture revolve both, right? It's convenient for us for. Revolve this cylinders and the two cylinders right here by using the revolve. Okay, so first mm, we make the sketch first. Okay, and we we first build this cylinder right here. Okay, just the the lower part the cylinder, not the the top of it. Okay, the cylinder, and I'm going to use the polar rectangle. Use for the polar rectangle here. I can, I can build it as like this, like this, see that? So I, I can get the, the bottom origin right here, see that? And we make a dimension of it. So it's just for someone uh didn't do the, the homework or just for someone have some problems in the homework, okay? So I will do, the, do it again for you, all right? I will do it again. If someone, had already done the homework. Um, so please just, just pay some attention about it. And I will just spend uh, some, some little time for this, okay? And for this one here, the length of here is two, four, one. Okay, and for this one here, it's the half of one, two, zero, so it's 16. And now we can end sketch, right? And for this sketch, we use the revolve feature right here. And the anxious of revolve, 
revolution is this one, okay? So the cylinder has been done, right? And now um, <coughs> we're going to build this cylinder right here, which is close to this bigger one, right? So we look at this, this in front face, all right? Is that, is that too fast for me, uh, too quick for me to, to explain? Mm -hmm. I'm go uh, I'm the speed of my speed of my explanation. Is that okay? No, it's okay, Lord. It's okay. You can go. All right. Okay. Uh, so, so for this one here, uh, we just look at the front surface, the front plan, right? And we make a we will make a center line right here. Okay, the center line. Here, center line is it's at the middle, middle of the of middle of the cylinder. Okay, and this is the crossing. Okay, crossing. And when you finish your uh, your drawing, just press ESC on the keyboard. Okay, press ESC on the keyboard. And this is just the center line of the cylinder. All right. And so now we gonna be um determine the position of this one, of this center right here. So use the line right here and see that if you put the mouse on the on the perception right here, you will show the point and just give a line right here and press the SC, okay? And use this matter dimension right here, which is one three zero. Good. And for this one and the end of the dimension, okay, just place close diagram and just click this line right here. And it is for the construction, it's not for the for the body, right? It's just for construction, that's the compare to the reference line, okay. And <coughs> based on based on this line right here, okay, we draw we draw another line and go down, right? Go down vertically. Yeah, yes, the, the, the dimension is dimension. So what dimension should be? What's the, what's the distance between this point to to here? So it's two four one minus one sixteen. Is that right? So here's two four one minus one sixteen. The distance right here. That yes, okay, so it's 81, right? It's 81 right here, right? So for this distance, so I will make a mark on it. Uh, how to make a mark on it? Not quite convenient for me, just, just for this line, see that. For this bottom right here and to this uh to this middle point of the smaller system the smallest cylinder, the distance is two four one minus one sixty right okay and for and finish the dimension and for this one is the construction too all right and now let's see now we make another line based on this one. All right. Oh no, we need to we need to make a make a line cross. We need to make this this reference line right here, okay? So we should use the center center line right here. Also about center line right here. And cross this, cross this point, right? Which is cross this point, just from this point, from this point, and build a line right here. And use yes, right? And make a dimension of it. It's an angle right here, right? Angle right here is 45. See that? Is 45 right here, okay. So 
So we got this reference line right here. Good. And okay. Oops. Dimension and use a line right here. Um, uh, could you please just close your mind, please? Turn down your mind, please. Yes, thank you. And <coughs> for this one here, just build a line right here, okay? And make a relationship between this one and this one. Just press your control button so you can select them all, right? Just press your control button when you really want to select two or more parts, okay? And make them, and make them perpendicular, right? So, okay. And the dimension here is half of 100, right? So it's 50. And for this one here, just get another line. So we need to make a longer one, all right? Just make sure it's close to that. The reference line has been shown. It's a really intelligent SolidWorks, sort of right? It's really intelligent software. Just close the face and which is see that see that yellow line right here? See that it's being which means it's parallel from from the reference line, okay? And yeah. If you don't if you don't uh trust it, just make another uh another relationship between them. See that? Parallel. Okay, yeah. And get another line right here, see that? This reference, reference line has shown, see that? And just vertical to, to, this, to this reference line, okay? And press ESC. And finally, we got another line to fix this, to fix this rectangle, okay? So now we can, okay, click OK and add the sketch. Right, and select the sketch and use the revolve and axis of revolve from this axis. See that? It's down. Most of all, cast down, right? The biggest part has down. So now we are going to build the, uh, the connection parts right here and connection part right here. See that? Okay, just like the ear, right? Just like the ear. And I, I, I don't actually, I don't know what the meaning, uh, what's, the, what's the name of them, the, the um, technical name of them. But I know just the function of them are just the connection part, connection part, okay? So how do you make connecting parts? Um, let me make a big one first, all right? Let me make this one first. With firstly, Look at this face, okay? I'm sorry about that. Uh, press this face and look at it. So, uh, we need to build the... I don't think. Okay, let's build this one first, okay? This one first. Sorry about that. Let's build the small one first, okay? Let's look at this face. <coughs> All right, see that here is the here's a view of it, and this one the diameter of this one is same is same as the cylinder, to the right from this section you can see that uh, this diameter right here is same as the cylinder, to the right okay so we build a circle line and find the origin point okay build a circle uh, which is the same dimension line, okay? And if you just, you can just make a under, un make it unfully defined, that be better, okay? My hand, good. And, <coughs> uh, Make a center line right here, okay? 
uh, which is from the origin. Yeah. And here we go. Which is horizontal. All right. If you, if you want to make sure it's horizontal, just press this. Okay. Just press this horizontal right here. Okay. And the dimension of it is. It's half of 160, right? So it's 80. 80. And make another circle now based on this one, right? So the radius of the circle should be is five. The so five is 20, the radius is 10, right? And oh, it's quite small, I think. Yeah, it's small. Okay, and we build uh, a bigger one, which is the the, uh, the shape around this small one, right? The big one. And the dimension of it is is forty. The radius is equal to right? so it's forty. The phi is forty. All right. And now we want to make this line right here, right? Uh, we just can we can just build a, a line, whatever, just cross two of them, the middle of the, the circle. It's okay, and press ESC, okay, and use the relationship between them, between this one and press. Just 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 select the the line right here, okay, and press the control button on your keyboard, and put and press this one, just this one, the bigger one right here, and see that. Here comes a relationship between you can use the tangent and and then it yes so that it's, it's become tangent right and use a uh, and select this one too the same and press control and select the speaker one right here and the tangent See that so it's become a tangent line right here for for the two circles, okay, and use the trim and height is to cut the to cut the to cut this one to cut this here right to make a cut right here and this one here too, okay. And for this one, for this line right here, we can just use the mirror the mirror in height is quite convenient for us to do that, right? And Select this line and mirror about this center line right here. Can you see? It shows now, right? And for this part, the, the another part, the right part right here, you can also use the, uh, the mirror in type. It. And first, you need to make a center line, right? So it can mirror about this center line right here. Let's see. Yeah. And select all the and uh, select this one and press the control button all right and this one here and this one here and this one here see that all have been selected and mirror about this center line right here right is that <coughs> convenient for you to do that use the by use the mirror in type right okay mm, so now we just end the sketch, right? And for this one here, um, we just make the extrude on it. So this one, this one, this one, yeah, this one, and just uh, save and just keep the hole right here, okay? Because it's a hole right here, just so it doesn't set up just the little, the little circle, okay? And another question, and uh, one point right here is the direction of the extruded. Is that so? Uh, when we build the, the sketch right here, it's from it's from this plan, right? It's from this yeah. plan. So the direction of this uh, extruded should be inside of the inside of the cylinder right here. That would be correct. If you if you did it on the outside, side, there will be there will be uh there will be get it 
a little longer for the distance for the for the for the lens, right? So the the lens route of this shape is is twenty, and click OK. Yeah. Uh, did every of you uh know what I'm saying? Have you guys understand what I'm saying? Yes, okay, yes, okay. Great. Yeah. Great, great, great. All right. So so we need to make a whole line, right? But but we will do it later and I will tell you why. And for for this this one here, I'm going to make another connection part on the on the big one, right? And for this one here is quite easy make a sketch on it all right and so we what's that big one right dimension is 150 and make a, a center line across and from the origin right and which is horizontal right yeah just horizontal make sure it is. and the, the dimension of it is to the uh, to this little circle right here right? which is one three two right and for this one here we make another circle on it the dimension is 32 and bigger one yeah. <coughs> the radio is 30 so it's 60 right the five is 30, 60. okay it's the same way to make the tangent right let's build a build a line cross this point and this point it's longer it's okay here yeah, longer it's okay and press esc and uh, click on this one, select on this one, and select on the small circle and use tangent. Okay. And another one, another circle, tangent. Okay, good. And use the trim and tidy. This part here, this part here, and this part here. Good. Mm. And same thing, use the mirror in height, right? This one. And mirror about this line. Okay, so in the sketch, we make a stool right here, all right? So this one here, here, this one too. Okay. So for this one here, the direction is uh, the far away from the, the center, right? Because we built this one based on this plan, this plan, right? So it's 20, it's okay. 20. All right, now, so, so let me ask ask you a question. So it's two hole, right? The, the the hole from for the bigger one and the hole from the smaller one. So which hole should we build first? Can somebody tell me. You mm -hmm. say what? Which hole? Can, can, you, she, can you, you repeat it? The question. Please. The big one, Laoshi. The big one, right? Topper, topper one. The small. So which uh, which hole should we build at first? The, the, the big small one or the smaller one? The big one, sir. The big the one. The small one. The small one. <laughs> okay. Who said the small one? <laughs> me, me, Sally. <laughs> Sally. <laughs> Come on, you're just joking, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. The answer should be the bigger one first. So. Because if you build the, the smaller one right here, you don't know the you don't know the depths of the hole should be, right? If we build the, the bigger one right here, so that it's just close to to the to the whole surface. So that's we know the the depths of the, the smaller hole should be, right? And some of you maybe meet the meet the problem on it. All right. And 
also we make a circle on it, right? For the little one. That's for this one. The direction here is through, through all. Yeah. It's okay. Mm. That? Yeah. Oh, did I did I that make a dimension on it? Let me see. Yeah. I didn't make a dimension. Sorry about that. It's ninety. Right. It's ninety. And and oh, what's going on? <laughs> Maybe we should do it again. Okay, because I didn't make a sketch. I make a dimension. Yeah, for this one here. Just. Why did it show up? Let's let's check. What's going on here? Do it. I'll do it again. Okay. Look at this face first. No more to this face first, and make a sketch on it. Right, cool. Circle. Okay, and make a hole on it. Make a dimension on it. It's nice. Yeah, sketch. Okay, and make a. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we need to use the extruded cut, it's not the extruded goals. Sorry about that. Yes. My mistake. All right. Just through the fit, through all. Okay. That yeah, have to make a make a big hole on it. And so for this one here, we just look at this face and make a sketch on it. Make a we need to find the uh, where is the where is the middle point? Where's the middle point? Why it didn't show up? Why did it show up? Where is middle middle point? Okay, maybe we just make some left line right here, okay. Wait, did it here first? Oh you should. And this too. That's for construction. So Good, it shows. <laughs> okay. So for this one here, dimension is dimension is what's the dimension? Oh, 60. Okay. 60. Okay. And X a sketch. And for this one here, just just up to the surface. See that? Service we have for this one here, right? Yeah. The baby center right here after the service, and down. Great, good. You guys follow me to do that. <coughs> and of course, you can make yes, a cool. Okay, you guys make make a appearance. Change the appearance. That's nice. But this one here is blue. Mm, quite different. I think. But it's okay. Okay. And you can see the cross section right here. Hmm. Hide and this. This one. And use this. Good. So that we can make a check on it. So maybe some mistake we made, but we can make a check. Uh, by see the cross section wheel, right? Section wheel and uh, use the wire frame. All right. I think I think for this work, I I just explain explain it slowly. So I I hope you guys can understand what is going on and can 
can join by yourself. Is that right? Good. Yes, Lush. Yes, Lush. Okay. So and so. So for this this homework right here, right? And there's two points we need to pay attention to, which is uh the first point is is important this one. Let me just look here. For the for this one right here, okay. Uh the extruded part, because the extruded demand the direction should be uh into into the surface. It's go down to the surface. It's not it's not out out to the surface, right? See that? Because the the plan we build is right is right based on this plan right here. Right. The high, the highest plan right here. See that? So and for another one here is where we build the uh, we build on the the sketch is on this is on this plan. It's on this plan. It's lower plan. So it can just extrude out from to the outside. Right? It's different. And and another thing we need to pay attention to is uh which hole should we build first, right? We need to build, build the bigger one first. And then we need to uh, and we then we know uh what the depth should be just uh cut on up to the surface so that we we don't need to know depths of the of this smaller one. Okay? The two points that we need to uh pay attention to for this one, for this design. All right. <coughs> okay, Lausha. Hmm. Okay. For today's class, uh let's I I have tell I have told about that that we maybe we are going to make a little middle test. All right. Uh actually. I prefer it now to the text. It just test. It just a practice. I think it's a practice. Just I just want to show you how to make this thing right here. And I should be. Uh, yeah. Uh, some of us still like uh had troubles in starting the solid work. So we we are working with our our classmates. So how can we? How can we handle it? I mean, if some of you didn't, I mean, some of you didn't have have instead of uh, in, have the solid works right here, right? And yeah, our laptops, our laptops are so poor to, to install that. So, uh, and our our classmates they are using it. So, uh, all right, it doesn't matter. I know some of you, some of you just. Just uh didn't follow me to do the things, or just uh, didn't have set up this this sort of works right here successfully, or just uh we ex we, we exercise we exercise after after the class when our our friends can lend us laptop. Yeah, so I know that. So we, it's okay for exercise, we, yeah, we can okay, take okay. it for us as a homework and. Okay, you can you can listen to me. Just 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 listen to me, okay. Okay, for this okay. work here, it's not the test. I just want to show you how to make something really cool. Uh, and you can see the you can you can look at the video the video uh we, which we have record right for for every class we make a the record of the class right. You can see it after class. It's okay for me, right? Okay. I'll work. Okay. Okay. So I just want to sh show you how to make this. Right here. Uh, the, 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 the. This one. Yeah, really It's a really uh, it's a really cool model that made, and I will show you how to make it. All right, based. To based on the on the knowledge we have learned and skill we have learned about, and I will show you 
uh, based on the thing we have learned uh, how to how we can build this thing right here the ring it's like a ring but it's not a ring right it's the unit the unit small unit is its origin right so how, how can we build this thing <laughs> as i mentioned about that the basic unit of this design is polygon, right? And for the further observation, we can see that we can see that the basic unit should be like a Y letter right here. Y letter, you see that? You can see, you can see the feature right here. See that for the, the for the basic for the basic unit, it's a Y. It's like a Y letter. Right, <laughs> and so why is not a polygon? Not a polygon. So if the the uh, the unit is polygon, just like the three polygon right here, and we use a mirror function of it, so that uh, we can imagine that there'll be empty polygon right here. There'll be empty right here. So we just uh, build the the unit of it. Of its shape, like a Y letter. Okay, sorry about that. And <laughs> here I'm going to tell you, um, the, what what I would, what should we do? Uh, what should what should the process be like uh, for this part of work design? And first, we can see uh, we can just make a sketch. Oh, sorry, the sketch for this for this shape right here, right? The Y letter right here, and we use a mirror thing, okay? Use a mirror thing. All right. Before that, I will I will show you. Uh, I will show two uh two new functions and scales for uh for the base of build build this shape. All right. <laughs> Um, so, sorry about that, uh, it's a mistake. <laughs> and for this one here, uh, so about it. for for the basic unit of this of the shape right it's polygon but the smaller one is the the y letter and we use the mirror function to make a lot of them right but the mirror function is in the same plane right we have we have learned about it it's in the same plane and we need to get an angular curve through this like this just make like a ring right we need to get an angular curve service. So today we are going to learn about the new function right here. It's a flex right here. Flex. Maybe some of you, some of you didn't show the flex function right here. I can show you where to find it. Okay. It just in the customize and the command and the feature. See that here's a flex and just pull it out pull it out i already have it so so it's not, so it's not Wh which one lao shi which one flex all right see that in here the option uh the, the triangle uh besides the option right here see that oh, sorry about that. triangle triangle right here beside the option and use the customize and here is the command thing and here's the features thing and here's the flex that just press it and hold it and uh get it right here all right i already have one so i, I just 
this one. You guys know how to make it here? Yes, Lashi. Yes, yes. Okay, so it's a flex. The flex function is to flex the entirety in the same plane but within six degrees of freedom. Okay, and so next, let's learn about how to flex part first. All right, how to flex. So we close this one first and let's learn about it. So what's the class should, should be have break? What time should we have break? Uh, I think now. Now? Or maybe after this flex, maybe 10.50 or 55, it's okay. 55, right? 55, okay. Okay. Flex is quite an easy function to use. All right, so let's make a two boy first, right? Two boy first. Make a small replica five. Five, okay. And first one here is two. Okay. <clears throat> so, have it all of you guys got the flags right here? Okay, I think you got it. So yes, we use the flex and see that? Let's see, select this space. Select this uh, extruded to, to void. Right oh, here. sorry, Loshi, can you come again? About Me. flex. All right, so you, you got this item, icon right here, the flex function right here. You got it. You got it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's. Just we make a cube cuboid first, right? And we press this flex function right here and select this cuboid. And here is a bending. You can see it. It's a bending, twisting, tapering, and stretching. Right? For the bending one first, we can change the the angle to right set 30. See that? It will be bending like 30 degree. So we can make it big, bigger, or just about 180. It's a half a ring, right? We make it 60. Become a ring. See that? Yeah. Okay, it's a bending one. And here's a twisting. Twisting is which is being to from the Z plan, from we 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 just row row it from the Z plan, and the bending is from the let me see maybe the X plan or Y plan, right? It's from the Z plan for the twisting. And this one, thirty or fifty. That yes. Um... You can try it on your computer, whatever the parameter you have set, okay? Mm. Let's try it. And the, the tapering right here. And the tapering right here, I think, is quite, uh, quite more like the, uh, more like the draft. It's like the draft, right? So it's just like the draft function. Did I told you about the draft, draft function? No. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I didn't tell you about the draft function. It's okay. We don't we don't use that. Can tell you about later, okay? And subtraction subtraction function right here just to change the the length of the the shape, right? The length of the part design. And we can make it longer or make it shorter, shorter. Whatever you want. So it's the Lashi. it's a flex function. Yeah. The tapering. Um, yours was starting from the baseline, but mine is starting from the center. 
Is there any problem? Is there any reason for that? Oh, give me pardon, please. The, can you go back to the tapering? The tapering. This one? Yeah. Mine, the tapering starts from the center. I don't know why. From the center? Yeah. Hmm. I think it's according to the, according to here. You can, you can just change the, change yeah, the. Yeah, it's because we're applying X, Y, Z okay. and stuff. Mm hmm Yeah, that's your fault. Yeah, <laughs> it's oh. only, it's not only for the, uh, for the parameter you can change right here. You can change that's a trade one, it's a trade parameter right here too, that's the same, okay? That's like just, just 90. But when you design a, a part, right? Uh, you need to know, you need to know the, the parameter that what we should set, right? Uh, okay. It may be make some calculation maybe, or just make some uh, uh, modeling design, right? You need to, <coughs> you need to figure it out at right first. So you know the, the different parameter you have to say, to set, right? Okay. I think it's a function that flex automatic flex, right? Okay, let's have, let's have a break, okay? Break. Okay, yes. okay.
Okay, guys, I think it's time to time to start class, All right? Hey, Ryan, go back. Okay, now she. Okay. Yes, uh, Lash. So just wait for a minute, okay? Uh, So for the uh for the flex function back here, I want to make another example. All right, we just delete this one. Delete this one. Delete the sketch. So for the last class, we we had learned how to make a ring, right? By by using the by using the revolve close here, right? The revolve function back here, we can make a ring. We can also make a ring by using the flex function right here. Okay, so we we'll make a we we'll make a circle sketch and make a dimension of this circle. All right, all right, and then a sketch, and we made a cylinder. So for this cylinder right here, we can use the Flex function and just make the use the bending right here. It's okay for the, for the 360. So we got a ring, right? See that? Oh, if you didn't show the, the geometry right here, uh, you can you can you can choose and you can select. You can unselect select this hard edge, edge right here. So it will show. So that is a little ring, right? We can use the flex to make make a ring too. Okay, it's not only for the revolve both. Or maybe you can just make it like one eighty. So it's a half of a ring, right? And you can make a mirror. This place and body the mirror is this one. Good, so it's a ring. That okay, that's the function of the the flex, right? And the next function I want to introduce is the to this one first. All right, it's the offset entities. The offset entities is, is really important for us. But actually, I have I had already tell you how to make the offset on the surface and the the offset of offset in entities. I didn't mention about it, right? I didn't tell you how to use it, right? So so. So now I'm going to tell you how to use the offset in practice. All right. It's the same. We choose a pen and make a feature on it. Okay. We use this center rectangle. And we got a rectangle right here. We get the dimension on it. 30. So this one here. Okay. Uh, this function. The offset function <coughs> is mainly used to facilitate sketch modification based on the completed sketch. All right, completed sketch, which is completed. Okay, so uh, we have already built this rectangle right here, and use the offset entities. We can select this place, select this this line right here, and here is a select chain, which means it will, it will offset all the chain entities, right? If we don't set this one, it's only one have been selected. 
right? And here we can uh, set the parameter right here. And that is a, is a, not a sketch I made based on the, based on the offset entirety. Okay. We just revise it, revise it, okay? And that the chain the, all of the the line of the rectangle have been slapped because of the chain we have used a slap chain right and we use the reverse the reverse one so if we reverse it will become uh, coming the another in the different direction of the of the, the sketch right and here is the dimension we can choose apply and six, whatever you want. And we can make a construction of the geometry we have made, right? Just for the basic geometry is the, here is the basic geometry, right? And here is the offset geometry. Okay, so we got a reference line right here. All right, this is I'm going to tell you because uh, for, the, for the work, we are going to we're going to do that we need to use this function, okay? Mm. And now we're going to the, to the main problem, okay? For this one here. All right, so everybody just folks, just folks to the class, okay? Uh, we're going to make a little bit of difficult thing uh, right now. Thank you, Lars. For this one here, see that uh, we can see the sketch on it. We can see the sketch on it. Right, I, would, I have to tell you about that. The smallest unit is a Y letter, right? And okay. how we move, how we make this Y letter? So we can make it. We can make polygons first, right? And and one polygon, and based on the polygon we have, we can make a mirror thing right here. We make a mirror thing, or make me maybe the pattern thing, right? Pattern thing. So we got three polygons, and we got this sketch, which is like a Y letter right here. You um you don't you don't need to know why we uh why we why the basic unit is Y. But for the next uh for the for another uh, practice maybe in the future, you need to learn to how to how to find the the basic unit unit of the geometry. Okay? So for this one here I will tell you that the basic unit unit is the Y letter. All right, and from now I'm going to show you how to make this uh, this big donut right here. All right, it's not a big donut. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, so let's move. Let's let's start. We make a new new part design, and we make we look at this uh, front surface. All right, we got a polygon. Polygon, see that the polygon which is like this direction. Make sure to make sure this one is work. This, this line here is vertical, right? Laoshi, can you yeah. repeat again, please? Repeat again, okay. Just there's a polygon right here, and this line here. See that this yellow line right here should be should be vertical. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. And here is the dimension of the polygon. That's its length of this this line, not like this one. 
the length of this line, okay, is, is five. It's five millimeter, all right? Down. I will do it really slow so for you can catch me up to follow me to do that. I guess down is work. Yes, the machine. Okay. And now we use the, the circular sketch pattern rescue. The circular sketch we have heard, we have learned about it. And press this triangle right here and select the circular sketch pattern. Okay. And for this for this one here, the direction we need to choose, just press it. And press at, at this button, this point right here. This point, see that? 2.6. Okay, and and now we're going to uh, make a pattern line, three of them, right? And the, end, the entirety to pattern is this one, right? You guys done it? Mm -hmm. Done it? No. So so I'll right, we'll do it again, okay? We'll do it again. So we got polygon right here, okay? And use the circular sketch pattern. And for this one here, we click this, we click on this. So so we can select the uh, point right here. This point, this point. This point. See that? Yes. Point six. All right. And uh the numbers to instance is three, okay, three. And the entirety to pattern is this one, is this polygon. And click OK. Yeah? Yes, love she done. All right. <coughs> so. And now we are going to use the offset entities okay offset entities we need to first uh select this reverse right here and uh make it and dimension of it is 0 0.5 okay then you can just select this one and this one and this one here whatever the uh whatever the the line, the line you select, but that's the one of the polygon, all right? One of the line of the polygon, because we we have already selected select the chain, so we just only want need to select one line for one polygon, so it will be fine. See that? Have you guys done it? Yeah. Okay, and the parameter here is zero point five, and then please right here the construction geometry. Please select both of them. Okay, both of them. So it will show the the con the construction line, right? And based on the construction line here. Uh, we we select all of them, all right, and often I'm for construction. Just click click the option right here, the full construction right here. Just click it twice, it will be become the become construction, all right. Select all of them and click on the full construction. Twice, maybe some of you uh, didn't show it. Uh, show it the construction line. Uh, whatever, if just click twice, it will show. All right. And here's the construction line right here. So we can build a build a bigger Y letter on it according to the construction. Okay. Have you guys done it? Yes, Laoshi. Yes. Opposite entirety. Good. Okay, so we move 
All right, for so this line right here, we build from this middle point, from the uh, the top one, top polygon, all right? It's in the middle, from the middle point right here, and to this point right here, I will be do it really slow, so you can uh, see it clearly, all right? Right here, oh, sorry, I made a mistake. <laughs> Not right. right here, just make a, <clears throat> Revise okay, it's control plus Z. All right, <laughs> delete it. Sorry about it. Make another line all right. from the middle point and to this one to this point right here. Just the, this one, this polygon, and for, for the lower point right here. And the second, and the third one is this point. And Fourth one is this point, the middle point of this one. Just follow me to do that. I will be doing really slow. Okay. And this point, this middle point right here. And this one right here. And this one right here. And this middle point here. And this one here. And this one here. Bottom. All right, we fix it. Down, guys. Yeah. Do you get sad? My my offset has a problem. Actually, give me pardon, please. My offset <coughs> has a problem. They are intersecting at the middle. The offset has a problem. All right. Uh, okay. Maybe I got that. I know some of you maybe got some problem with the offset. So I will do it again from the offset, right? Because it's it's really it's not that easy for uh for all of us to to follow my work. All right. Oh, sorry. I do it. So do the circular circular pattern right here. First, choose this point and three of them, and in part is this one. Okay. And for this, oh, for the God. opposite entirety right here, okay, we select all of them and use the opposite entirety and select the revise. Oh no, we have, we have already selected this, this place too. So don't do that. So press the, the, the no, okay? And we just don't select them all. We just go uh, go straight, select the uh, the entire right here, okay? And here we select this revise here, reverse here, and select chain and add dimensions. And the dimension is 0 0.5, okay? And just choose one line of each polygon, okay? This line here. That and this line here and this line here and <laughs> select the basic select the construction geometry for the base geometry and the opposite geometry. Okay, yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, for this for this move, it's really important for us to build the big Y, right? Does everybody have have any question about it? No. Okay. So let's make another. Uh, oh no. So for for here we select them all, right? And make it for construction. You see oh, that? I can select off the with Y. Give me pardon, please. Uh, the offset mode, I can't select it. I don't know why. You can select it. All right. <laughs> I think I'm going to do it again because it's, it's part of work. It's really important. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Just one more, one more last time. All right. Just last time. <laughs> if you don't know how <laughs> you do it, it didn't work, um, you can try it later or just. I don't want to try later because it's really important. 
for you to do the conveniences for the button. You do it really slow at this time, okay? For the object entirety, okay? You just select the add dimension and the reverse and the select chain, all right? Three, three of them, see that? Select them. And here we got the the base geometry and the offset geometry. Just select them, all right. And you just press on the one of your polygon line, all right. That's the outer line, not the inside. Okay, that's one line, one line. See that? Yeah. And another polygon line, all right. And this one line. And Press OK. Down. Work. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look. Okay. That's really great. Really good. Okay, select them all. All right. And just for construction. Click twice. Construction. Construction. Click it twice. Okay. And close that. So that it becomes construction. And for the line right here, I want to build the build the, the bigger that's <coughs> a bigger Y letter, right? The Y letter right here. This line we from this point, this point, the, the top one, right? The top one on the left side. This point, the middle point, right? Got it? And to the to this point right here, the, this one, this polygon right here. And for this point, not this one, okay? It's for this point, for this lower point right here, okay? And to this point, to this inside point, okay? And to the middle point. And So about something okay from here to here okay the middle point right here and to this point right here and to this point right here into this middle point right here and for this one here inside one <coughs> this one this one here this one here this one here and yeah. Oh, you yeah. have to close this last one, Lashi. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Have you guys down? You can. Oh, uh, I will. I will zoom it so you can see clearly what the, what is the lines going on. Okay. So I will give some times. Wow, it requires some time, really, and attention. Can we pardon, please? It's really not easy, but interesting. I'm going to try. All right, let's try, OK? Let's notice this one here. and. Uh, Lao Shi, yeah, yeah. Uh, can you pin any feature on the on the on the screen here, like you you pinned flex? Uh, pin flex. What does I mean? I didn't get. Uh, like, uh, you dragged flex. Uh, the feature of flex, uh, to to the screen so that you can access it very easily. Yeah, yeah, there. Uh, this one. Can I do the same with other features? Is it possible? Uh, I mean, you mean you mean get another easy example for you? Oh uh, no 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 no. Uh, okay, wait. 
No, no worries, no shit. I will text it to you. Okay, okay. All right, have you guys all finished this big wire letter right here? I got some problems. Yeah. It's okay, I'll do it again, okay? Do it again. I just want to make sure all of you uh, can be can down this work, okay? So we got a reference the construction construction line right here, and we use the line, and from this middle point to this point, this point, lower point, see that lower point right here, and to this point right here, and to this middle point here, and to this middle point right here, and to this point, and to this point. And to this middle point right here, and the middle point right here, and this point right here, this point right here, this point right here, this point right here, and hit it. <laughs> All right, and press ESC. Yeah. All right, I hope you guys down it, okay? Because yeah. we are going to move on. It's not too much time for us. All right, down, down is work, and we exit the sketch, okay? Exit sketch, and select the sketch right here. We make the extrude. And that extrude, the extrude learns then dimension is one, okay? It's one millimeter. And we got a big Y, big Y letter right here. All right? Have you guys yes. all done? Okay. Mm -hmm. And, okay, use the mirror function right here. See that? The mirror function in the feature one, in the feature one, not in the sketch, okay? In the feature one, the mirror function right here. And select this face, the right face right here, okay? The right face right one okay and just click okay See that the two y yes. and the same thing use this mirror right here and select this face the right face right here and for for this time just delete the mirror okay and use the body to mirror here it's not a feature to mirror it's body to mirror so let's Select this this one. So we got four Y. Good. Good. A four Y. Okay, do it again. All right, do it again. We got two Y first, and then we use a mirror, and we mirror at this face, and we choose the body. Body to mirror, see that? It's body. Let's choose it. We got four Y. All right, and we continue to mirror these things. This time we choose this bottom place right here, a small, the smaller one, or the small rectangle right here. And we delete to clean the section. Right click it and click to clear the section. And the body to use the body to mirror. We use this one. All right, body to mirror. <coughs> Good. You guys done it? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, do it again. All right. Yeah, it was, it was missed. Though. For this step right here, okay, for this step, we got four Y's, right, four Y letters. And you just use the mirror. And we select this face to mirror, this one. We select that second one, okay, to mirror. And the body to mirror is, the body to mirror, it's not a feature to mirror, all right? It's a body to mirror is, we select this one. We step down there. Okay. So we got four Y. It's more like a polygon, right? It's polygon. 
<laughs> and we could and we keep mirror on it. All right. This time we select this face, the middle face, right here. And we clear, we delete the, the feature because we need to use a body to mirror. All right. It's not a feature to, to mirror, it's a body to mirror. All right. We select the body and click OK. That. And the last one, all right, it's the last time. Mirror again for this face, the middle face right here. And we delete it. We just use the body mirror. Same. All right, we've done the, the plan one, all right. See that? The polygon are in the same plan right now. Okay, so all of you, I will all of you guys down this work. Mm -hmm. No. Not done yet. Almost, almost like it. All right. Have any of you done this work? No. Not done yet. Okay, I will show you again. I will show you to the very beginning. Okay, from the Y part. From the Y part right here. Okay. Have you guys have you guys fixed the right the Y part right here? Okay. If you uh if you already done this done this finish a step before, it's okay. Okay, just. Just wait for me to go into the, the step you have, have done, all right? Just for this Y part right here, we use a mirror. And for this face, we want to mirror, all right? For this face. And the body to mirror is for this one, okay? Okay, yeah. And we make another mirror for this face, the right face, right? Right face right here. And this time we use the body, body to be just body to be. And click OK. So it's four Y right here, right? And from, from now, we're going to use a mirror and mirror by this face, yeah. the second one, second one, second photo, all right? Photo face. And use. Use the body to be body me. Yeah. And right here. <laughs> yeah. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Y, right? Eight Y right here. And click using the mirror. The face, select this one. The middle, the middle. Okay, the middle one. <laughs> and the body, the mirror. Select this, this one. So it's 16 Y, I think, right? 16 Y, Y letter, all right? It's Y, Y letter. If you don't know what I'm saying about Y, it's Y letter, all right? And hit mirror on this face, this bottom and the middle face, all right? And body to mirror for this one. Yeah? I think it's 32 Y letters. Just don't count on it. All right, you just need to make sure that you have one, two, three, four, five, five mirrors steps right here. Down, have you guys done? Have any of you guys done this work now so far? Yes, yes, Loshi. Loshi, I think mirroring is easier, but uh, you know, after offset, I hear you choose some some part. It's kind of messed up for me. I don't know about about other guys. Uh, you mean after war, after after offset, offset. So so you have done this work right now, right? It's far away from here. 
far away from here. Oh, you mean the offset you have hidden down, right? Yeah, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. I just want all of you to know what I'm going Okay. So, from this part, polygon, we make a circular sketch on it. All right. For this part, bottom, just take this one here and this block is right here. here. Bottom right here. All right. And this point right here, and this three of them. So, this point and three of them, and the entire feature pattern is this one. Okay, so we got three points right here, and it's a it's the most important step right here is offset, right? Offset. Just press off this function right here and select uh, add dimension and reverse and select chain. All right, three options. Just select it. Select them. Okay. Okay. And the parameter here is 0 0.5. All right. 0 0.5. And to select the base geometry and the offset geometry right here. All right, so now choose the line of one, one of the polygon and one of them, the one of one line of them, right? Just one line. See that? So, offset entirety has been show. And another, another one, another line, which is in the another polygon. See that? Just one line, okay? Because we selected the select, select chain already. And for this one here, okay. And click OK. Now she. Yeah. You see the the problem that I'm having is that the 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 polygons, sorry, yeah, the polygons are not a face; they are just lines. So when I click on the line, only one line is selected, not the whole polygon, like not oh. the whole surface. You mean uh, I've been, oh, yeah. So. Like when I'm when I offset and I click on the line, it just shows the line. It doesn't show the whole entity. You mean you need a circular sketch pattern? Yes. Okay. All right. From here, you choose on this. You you just press this here. Okay. Just select the the reverse direction. Just at this point right here. Okay. Set point six. This point right here. See that at this point, and three of them, and the entire thing is prepared for the pattern is this one, and three polygons will show. And yeah. I know you mean you you mean is in the offset entirety. See that? Yes. Yeah. You uh you did did you choose this one to select chain right here? Did you select it? Yeah, I think that was the problem. Thank you. All right. So, so make sure you select all of the three of them. So that the first one is add a dimension, and the second one is reverse, and the third That's one is right. select chain. All right. Just yes, select yes, three yes. of them. All right. Thank you. And here is the construction geometry. As select the base geometry and the offset geometry, both of them. Okay. Yes. Right. Then now you can just select one of the line of one polygon right here. Just one line. Okay. That and another polygon line, all right, and the third one, and click OK. Yeah, yes, 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 thank you. I think from now I'm okay. <laughs> Good, this one has already done it. Good. Okay, from here now, so we make we want to make it 
like a construction, right? So select them all and for construction here we double click on it. So it will show like a construction reference line right here, okay? And press those diagram. And we make a line on it. A line here, I already told you about. All right, <laughs> make it a third time, all right? From the middle point up here and this point up here and this point up here and this middle point right here and this middle point right here. What's wrong? Down, good. All right, this is the basic, uh, basic unit we 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 want, right? So we end the sketch and just extrude sketch, which dimension is one millimeter, okay? One millimeter. And now we go to the mirror mirror function, right? The mirror one. The mirror. The first one is mirror on this face. The right face, okay. And mirror body, body of the mirror is this one, okay. And click OK. So it's too wide right here. So that's so good. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. And make another mirror. And this one, and this face, right, right face. And. Uh, Lasha, how much is the measurement for X two? Thank you, Harlem, please. Uh, the extrude measurement. You did it now. It's one. It's one millimeter. Okay. All right. One millimeter. All right. Okay. So you have just done this one, right? I will do the mirror one. All right. So just follow me. Mirror. This face. See that? Select this face. The mirror. And the body to mirror is select this one. It's equal eye right here, okay? And use another mirror. Like this face this time, okay? The right face. And the body, use the body to mirror, all right? And for, it's four wide now. And for now, the mirror and this, this face, okay? And the body to mirror is this one. So it's eight wide now. And mirror for so this face, the middle face right here, okay. And the body to mirror is this one. All right, last one here. We got a mirror in this face, and the body left. Good. It's one, two, three, four, five, five, six, five mirror steps. Have you guys done it? Yep. Almost there, almost there. Almost there. Okay, we wait for a minute. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry about that, Lash. It's okay. It's okay. okay. It's really it's a little bit complex. That's it. But I, I just want to know how to make this thing. Yeah, sure. So you can show others. Oh, she said five yeah. times. Yeah, five times. So five times. The first time is at this at this face. And yeah. the second time is at this face. The right face, right face, and the bottom face, and the bottom face, and the bottom face. Right? Mm, yeah. That's it. Okay. It's finally one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's 30, it's 30, 32 wise, I think. All right, finishes mm, mirror thing. All right, yeah, we got is. a lot of wise, yeah. lot of lot of polygons in the in the plan, right? So now we want want to make it like a ring, to make it flex, to make it flex. All right. Yeah. So how do you make flex? Just press the flex. Okay. And the flex to the flex input is to select, select this face, select this one. All right. And 
use the bending function, okay? The bending function. And the, the degree it should be 1, 8, There, it's a half of the range, right? It's a half of it. Lashi. Yeah. Lashi, can you tell me how to how to make flex? Because here I don't I don't have flex. You mean? Yeah, I don't have here. You mean how to make it make it yeah. appear? Yeah. All right. It's as a triangle. See that the triangle which is beside the option right here. And the customize right here, see that? Yes. And here's a command right here. See that command. Yeah. Yes. And here is the uh, features. See that? The features right here. Yes. And here is the flex. Just pull it out. You right here. You got a feature. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I got All it. All right. So I will do it again, okay? We we'll do the uh, flex again, All right? Use the flex and select this this border this mode right here, and use the bending, right? The bending, and it's one eighty. Good. That we got half of the range. That. Yeah. I'm gonna call me. Wait. All right. Sorry about that. So we got half of ring. So we need another part, right? Another part. So we make a mirror again. All right. Use a mirror again. Mirror right here. And this time we mirror on this face. The middle one. The middle face. Yeah. The middle one right here. And the body to middle is. Just select this one. Good. Yeah, yep. <laughs> I hope so. <clears throat> okay, and so yes, now the, the most important step coming, right? Yeah. We need to another oh sorry, we just Put this back. We got I got two flags on the face. Of course I already have one. You make it really confused. Mm -hmm. Put it back. So just one flag right here. Okay. Okay. And use the function of the, the, the flags right here. Okay. We select on this one. On this one. On the view. Right? And I use the bending function function okay bending function and the angle of here is 30 all right it's minus 30 all right it's not 30 okay. it's minus 30 okay okay and for here uh here is a, it's a parameter we set right and for here the trade right here for this three of them, this three of them. Can you guys see it clearly? This yes. one here is lighting, okay? And this one here is lighting. And this one here is lighting. Yeah? Oh. So for, the, for the last three one, last three one, the angle is lighting. Off, yeah. right? Done. Yeah, okay. And say the flex option right here, you. You just flex the accuracy, make it at max, maximum, okay? Let's do this, this one to maximum. All right, and okay, click okay on it. Hey. <laughs> oh, that's here mm -hmm. now. That, down? Loading, loading. <laughs> loading, okay. It's really... It maybe takes some time because it's shape, this model is a little bit complex, all right? Yeah. All right, if you're down, just tell me. Because this class is a bit about to, about to over, all right? 
Yeah, Dan Russia. For me, I don't know. Love she done too. Okay, down. All right. Yeah. So what can we uh, what are we gonna do now? We make a we are uh, going to you see that just a uh, 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 one of the second. part of the ring, see that? We, we make it zoom yeah. it smaller and see that it's one part of the of the whole whole ring, right? So what are we gonna do? Yeah. We're gonna use the the circular pattern right here. The circular pattern. But what uh which axis should we pattern to? All right, which is the axis? This axis right here, right? So how to yeah. how to get this anxious? It's an easy way for us to do that. Did you guys see the 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 eyes on here? The eyes on here. See that? Yeah. Yes. And the, it's a triangle beside it, right? Yeah. And see here, it's a it's a real temporary temporary anxious. Mm. Yes. And see and select it. So this show a temporary axis is really intelligent for for the SolidWorks. It knows uh, where it's going to build this axis. See that? It's just the middle of the, it's just the origin of the ring. See that? So for here, the, the, the sorry, sorry, can you come again? Uh, temporary middle uh, that one. Yeah, it's a, it's besides the eyes right here. It's a in a triangle. See that? Let's pick the triangle right here. Link the triangle. And the the fourth one, the wheel, the wheel temporary axis, got it? It will show up the temporary axis. See that? Okay, I hope you got it. And for the further uh, circle, it, but it's not showing. Uh huh. Even me, I select it, but it's not showing. Yeah. Not showing. Select it. Repeat the. Repeat the. Yeah. Repeat the all right, so try try press this one. Press the eye. Press is the eye one time. It will be showing. That show? No. No? Ayo. The temporary axis. Did it show? Okay, have some of you shown this one? Yes, okay. yes, that's my mission. All right, that's why it's not showing. It's besides. Maybe, maybe they should repeat the figure. But when mine came, it was very small. But when I repeat the figure, it became longer. Yeah, it's quite, it's quite small. And if you zoom it up or just, yeah. just uh, make a, make a, a useful middle button middle button to to re revolve the, the view will show i think all right from here just here okay and something may be hide this because of you you choose this you choose this one just click twice and we will show okay all right yeah. let's move on okay so for this one here i want to make a circular pattern Right, so circular pattern. The direction here we select this this one, the so temporary axis. Okay, and the, the angle is thirty uh, three six zero good, and uh, the number is is twelve. Good, it's twelve. Okay, and it's That's the body. It. It's the body. Is select a body, okay? Oh, sorry. That's weird. I can select the body. Okay, let's do it again. All right, because we can select the body. Circular pattern and choose the axis right here and choose the body, okay? The body right here. And just see that if you move your mouse to the shape. It will become all to orange color, okay? And select the body. Yeah. Good. And it's 360. And here is 12, okay? 
Yeah. And like, why is why is it twelve? Why is twelve? <laughs> it has been cal calculated. All right. It's okay. okay. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. All right. So now the whole thing has been built, but uh, we can we can just hide this empty first. Okay, hide it. Just press this eyes on it. And but this part of here is is complete. Uh, it's include different parts, right? The lot of parts, mm -hmm. the twelve parts of this work. So we want to make it uh to the one to the one part, right? So here is a function in the insert one. So see that in the insert, and here is the feature. See that here the feature. Yeah. And here is a combine combine function right here. You guys see that the combine function yeah. is in the insert and the features and the combine function. All right. Just select all of them. It may be take some time, all right, and click OK. Just wait for me, all right. So it become one part. It become one part. That. Yes. All right. But it's still loading, Lush. <laughs> My fans are blowing. It's okay. It's okay. It's just. Yeah, it's okay. It's bad. It's not so. <laughs> so. So, guys. So, today's homework is. I would prefer it's not a homework. It's that as a as just a test. For you to build this one. Okay. So you can you can uh just watch the report or just uh, watch to the videos record right? We have a record this this class right here, right? Yeah. Okay, it's have been recorded. So you can you can learn it from the record, and and build this build this model, and it's for the for the homework. Okay. Yeah. I hope you guys all of you. Uh, if you down this one, yeah, without the function of uh, that element inside of the eyes, it's impossible to make it. What is it? He's saying without, without the temporary axis, temporary because their temporary axis is not showing, so they can't show it. We, we can oh, temporary, temporary one, all right? Yeah, it's also the same for me. Temporary show, okay, temporary. Uh, so you you mean you didn't show the temporary function? Yeah, icon right not here. showing. All right, so you can search on here. That the customize right here. Customize. That, yes. Okay, the option, the option, and that option is the triangle right here, and it's customize right here. Okay, and here is a shortcut bars. All right. Yes. Uh, let me find it. Shortcut. Oh, no, no, no. The keyboard. Sorry about that. The keyboard. All right, the keyboard right here. And search for the. What is it? Tem temporary. See that? The temporary axis. Yes. And just make a shortcut of it. Whatever. Uh, just pay attention. Just like, for example, as Control A. Oh, but the control A is already used. So we change another one, all right? The control about control X. <laughs> already used. I should try control T, let's see. Mm -hmm. Try what? Control T, T. Control Z. T, T. T, okay. Control T. It's for geometry. Uh -huh. oh, oh, it's going on. Okay, control U is going <laughs> So. <laughs> Okay, it's just it's just a way for you to to find it out, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so now uh, you mean Loki you just need to type Q or Control Q. Control it's okay. U. So yeah, Control U's work. Control U's work. 
you just you can just uh, use the control U to show it up. All right, this is the way to find the uh, uh, the functions you didn't show it up. It's as a customize and the keyboard select the keyboard, and you can search for it. Search for P E M. You show the temporary access. See that and and just make a shortcut for it, and you can use it next time when you press the shortcut. Good. Clear. Even like that is not showing up. She not showing up. Maybe some no. maybe some of you hide hide the type. Just click the eyes. It will show. Nothing, Lashi. Nothing? Nothing. Hmm. All right. It's it's uh, the version of the Sleepbox. What's the version of your Sleepbox? It's 2020. It's 2021, Lashi. Mine is also 21, but it works. Yeah, 21. You got it, Sale? Mm -hmm. I got it. I'm done. You done? Wow. Yeah. Uh, oh, that's okay, Lashi, maybe you let one of them share his screen, then we then you can see what's going on in their PC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of you please, uh, if you you didn't show the answers, just share you or uh, share you share that. Lava, lava, okay. share your screen. Let's see. Okay. Enable. Now she got to stop first. Oh, I, I, I'm going to stop my share, right? So yeah. Okay, let me show you. All right, show yours. Until now, nothing. Someone, I think someone is sharing. Okay, I think no. Okay, let me see that. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, this one. The option is already here. And and press the uh, eyes, press the eyes, press on the eyes. Yeah. Take Nothing rushing. Oh, press again, try it again. Nothing. No. What? <coughs> Oh, it's not showing. All right, try to uh select the, the view. The view. View. Yeah. Mm. View on the on the top side. On the top side, the view display. Yeah, the left, left to the left, to the left, the left. Is that the view, which is besides the field and the edit. That. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. View and here the display. Display, yes. Mm, and then this is. No, it's not in display. Okay, it's a toolbar. Toolbar, okay. Mm. Oh, and here is uh, in the hide and show in the hide and in the view, and here is the yes. hide and show. See that? And there is a temporary yes. uh, access. Just choose again. Let me try. And click, click one more time. <laughs> Didn't show? <clears throat> no. Um, All right, zoom in. Yeah. Maybe, maybe the the. The figure is not selected, so there's no temporary axis to show. The figure is not selected. Yeah, the temporary axis should be for the figure, but I think maybe, I don't know why, but maybe the figure, there's no temporary axis to show because the figure is not selected. Maybe maybe you should select the figure and try and see if you find it. Yeah. Uh, try this way. But I didn't select the figures. <laughs> Me too, I didn't. 
Nothing, bro. Nothing. Mm. All right, it's okay. Okay, I will find the, uh, after the class, I will search on the internet why it's going on, okay? Because okay, my love. in my computer is shown, but I, I will find and figure out why you you, you didn't show, okay? Okay, love, sure. Thank you. All right, I think it's time to break, okay? Have lunch. Okay, love, sure. Okay, thank you. All right, so, so don't, don't forget that the, the homework for this today is to build this one, okay? Build the shape. Okay, love, sure. According so, love, sure, I, need to, I need to build it again. Uh huh. No, no, no. You have if you have already done the work, you don't need to rebuild it again. Actually, okay. if you want to, it's okay. But I just want to make sure you all of you uh can can down this work. Okay. Okay. Now okay. should I send you a picture? Check if it's okay. If it's not okay, I'll rebuild it myself again. Rebuild again, sir. Sure. By what? By by which or what? No, by no. The chat box. Okay. Mm, good. I see that. Great. Okay. Great. So this is homework. All right. Okay. Okay. Mm. All right. I think it's time for today's class. See you guys. And and for that, for that one didn't choose and it's a temporary exit. I will. I will show. Will show school. So to do, to do the number is, I will record it. I will text it to you. Okay, love you. Seven zero. Can you give me pardon, please? Uh, I, I sent you a request. My my student number seven zero. Seven zero. Okay. Yes. And I sent you a request in the WeChat. There zero. are two guys, seven zero and seven seven. The other guy is seven seven. All right, so you are seven 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 zero. Didn't show it. Okay, okay. I will find it. What's what is going on? Okay, but Lush, okay. I think maybe when they when they start all over, they it's gonna show. Maybe they start. Yeah, I will try again. Step step, it's gonna show. I will try because again. I I use the same app with them, so I don't know. Maybe <laughs> maybe let's hope. <laughs> all right. Okay, we will find we will find a way to to solve that problem. Okay. Yes, Lush. Okay. Okay. See you, see, okay. See you guys. Bye. See you. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Thank you. Bye. 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 You love her. Oh. I think I think the you see the part where you rotate the 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 part for the flex. Mm. I think maybe it's from that part. It's either that part. Or the or the or the part of wait when you were drawing at at the how do they call it circular part in that mm -hmm. side did you did you see an axis that axis was there when when I was drawing my circular part so after that it left like when when you click on when I click on circular part I see it the exit I want you start, start all over, start all over. When you start all over, I'm sure. Because the first time I, I did my own tool, this, that axis was not showing, so I couldn't do my circular part. Then I started everything from the beginning. Yeah, I will try again. I will try again. I'm doing so hard. We need to...